Welcome to our exploration of creation, intelligent design, and the remarkable evidence of a creator. Today, we're venturing into the intricate world of chimpanzees, creatures that captivate us with their uncanny similarities to our own species. Chimpanzees, our closest living relatives, are a marvel of nature. They are social creatures, living in communities that can number up to 100 individuals, each with its unique role and status within the group. This complex social structure is a testament to the remarkable intelligence of these creatures, hinting at a sense of order and purpose that goes beyond mere survival. Now let's delve deeper into the world of chimpanzees. Consider their ability to use tools, a skill that was once thought to be exclusive to humans. Chimpanzees can fashion sticks into tools to extract termites from their mounds, use stones to crack open nuts, and even use leaves as sponges to soak up drinking water. This ability to manipulate their environment in such sophisticated ways speaks volumes about their cognitive capabilities. Furthermore, chimpanzees are not just intellectually gifted, but they also exhibit a rich emotional life. They express joy, sorrow, fear, and even empathy, emotions that we humans can easily relate to. They care for their young with tenderness, mourn the loss of their kin, and even engage in conflict resolution within their groups. As we delve into the intricate world of chimpanzees, we cannot help but marvel at their complexity. Their social structures, tool-making abilities, and emotional depth offer a glimpse into a world that is strikingly similar to ours, yet unique in its own right. The question then arises, could this extraordinary species, with its complexity and intelligence, be a product of random chance? Or does their existence point to a more intricate design, a deliberate orchestration of life as we know it? Could this extraordinary species be a product of random chance, or an outcome of careful design? As we journey further into the world of creation and intelligent design, let's ponder on these questions and perhaps in the process, gain a deeper understanding of our own existence. The complexities of life go far beyond chimpanzees. Imagine, if you will, the microscopic world within us and around us. A world so tiny, yet so complex, it dwarfs our understanding and challenges our perception of reality. One such marvel of this minute world is deoxyribonucleic acid, better known as DNA. DNA is like the universe's most intricate language. It's a genetic code, a blueprint that orchestrates life's functions. It's responsible for the color of your eyes, the tone of your skin, and even the shape of your nose. But it doesn't stop there. DNA is also responsible for the fluttering of a butterfly's wings, the towering height of a redwood tree, and the intelligent behaviors of our friends, the chimpanzees. A single strand of DNA is packed with more information than the most advanced supercomputers. This isn't hyperbole, it's a fact. The human genome, for instance, contains around 3 billion base pairs of DNA. If you were to type out this information, it would fill around 200 thick books. And yet, all this information is stored within the nucleus of a cell so small, it's invisible to the naked eye. Now you might be wondering, how can such an intricate design come to be? What are the chances that the right molecules came together in the right sequence to create this complex code? The odds would be astronomically low. It's like expecting a tornado sweeping through a junkyard to assemble a fully functional jumbo jet. This complexity suggests that life isn't a product of random chance, but of meticulous design. It points to an intelligence that is far beyond our comprehension, an intelligence that has crafted life with precision and detail. The staggering information encoded within DNA hints at a meticulously crafted design rather than a mere explosion of matter. As we delve deeper into the mysteries of life, we may find that we are not the result of a cosmic accident, but the product of an intelligent design. The Big Bang Theory, often touted as the genesis of the universe, posits an explosion leading to the formation of everything. It's a widely accepted scientific explanation of how our universe began, about 13.8 billion years ago. A hot, dense singularity exploded and expanded, leading to the creation of particles, atoms, stars, galaxies, and all the cosmic wonders we witness today. But let's take a moment to ponder this. The Big Bang suggests that all this complexity and order arose from an event of intense chaos, a massive explosion. Can we truly attribute the meticulous design of life and the universe to a chaotic event? In the heart of this explosion, somehow, against all odds, the perfect conditions for life were set. The right elements formed, stars ignited, planets took shape, and eventually, on a small blue dot we call Earth, life sparked into existence. This life evolved from simple organisms into a dazzling array of species, each with its own unique set of characteristics, behaviors, and abilities. From the microscopic bacteria to the majestic blue whale, from the delicate butterfly to the intelligent chimpanzee, 
Each organism is a testament to the intricate design and complexity of life. So we're left with a compelling question. Can the Big Bang, an event of extreme chaos and randomness, truly account for the intricate order we observe in the universe? Can it explain the precise balance of natural forces that allow life to exist? Can it justify the complex behaviors and intelligence we observe in species like chimpanzees? As we delve deeper into the mysteries of the universe, we find ourselves confronted with a paradox. The more we understand about the universe and life, the more complex and ordered they seem. Yet we're asked to believe that all this order and complexity stemmed from an event of pure chaos. However, can chaos alone explain the intricate order and delicate balance that sustain life? As we continue our journey of understanding, perhaps we'll find that there's more to the story of life in the universe than the Big Bang Theory alone can tell. The universe's finely tuned constants from gravity to the forces that govern atomic interactions are so precisely balanced that they permit the existence of life. Now let's delve deeper into this concept. Imagine the universe as a high-tech spaceship with countless controls and dials. Each one of these controls must be set with exact precision. Too much or too little, and the spaceship could veer off course or worse, explode. This is a metaphor for the fine-tuning of our universe. Take gravity, for instance. It's not just a force that keeps us grounded. It's a complex constant, keeping planets in orbit, stars burning, and galaxies from tearing themselves apart. If gravity were even slightly stronger or weaker, stars might not form, planets could be flung into the void, and life as we know it would be impossible. Then there's the strong nuclear force. This is what binds protons and neutrons together in the nucleus of an atom. Too weak, and atomic nuclei wouldn't hold together. Too strong, and protons could bond more readily, leading to a universe filled with heavy elements, but lacking in lighter ones like hydrogen, which is essential for life. And these are just two examples. There are numerous other finely tuned constants, from the speed of light, to the ratio of the electromagnetic force, to gravity. Each one is set with such precision that even slight variations would result in a universe hostile to life. Some might argue that this fine-tuning is mere coincidence, a stroke of cosmic luck. But when we consider the precision required, the odds of this happening by chance seem astronomically small. The fine-tuning of the universe doesn't necessarily prove the existence of a creator. It does, however, raise profound questions about the origins and nature of the universe. It invites us to ponder the possibility that the universe, in all its complexity and precision, might not be the result of random chaos, but of meticulous design. Even slight alterations would render life impossible. When we examine the harmony and precision in the universe, from the smallest DNA strand to the grand cosmos, it's rational to contemplate the existence of an intelligent designer, a creator. From the synchronized dance of galaxies to the intricate workings of a single cell, there's a profound complexity that permeates every layer of existence. Think about it. The precise balance of natural forces that allow life to exist, the intricate patterns of ecosystems that sustain myriad species, the delicate balance of a planet finely tuned to support life, it all seems too finely orchestrated to be an accident. Indeed, the idea of a creator does not diminish the beauty of the natural world or the elegance of its laws. Rather, it enhances it, painting a picture of a universe not born out of chaos, but out of mindful intentionality. A universe where every star, every planet, every living being, from the mightiest blue whale to the humblest microorganism, is part of an intricate cosmic symphony. Yet, this is not a call to abandon scientific inquiry. Far from it. It's a call to expand our understanding, to embrace the possibility that science and faith can coexist, each shedding light on the other. It's a call to recognize that the pursuit of knowledge and the search for meaning are two sides of the same coin, both leading us towards the same ultimate truth. As we stand on the precipice of a new era of discovery, we must remember that science does not have all the answers. It is a tool, a powerful one indeed, but it is not the end-all be-all. There are mysteries that lie beyond the scope of our current understanding, questions that science alone may not be equipped to answer. In the end, the existence of a creator is not a question of science, but one of philosophy, of spirituality. It's a question that each one of us must grapple with in our own way. As we ponder the intricacies of life, the exquisite design in nature, and the remarkable order of the universe, perhaps the idea of a creator guiding the course of evolution and shaping existence isn't as far-fetched as it may seem.